What is up guys? Just want to give you a real quick update. I haven't posted a video in several months. Been working on my car, not the last two months because of the COVID-19, but I have got some things done. Um, the exhaust is almost done. And I'm pleased with how that turned out. Still need to make some brackets here for the rear these vice grips are at but the headers are installed and um, they fit super 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 tight uh, making these headers and this exhaust has definitely been the most challenging thing on this build so far need to also weld in the O2 bungs but that won't be that big of a deal have the Driver side header in. This uh, you can see here. We have four inches. And four inches to try to put six tubes in, plus two three to one collectors in a four inch space is pretty challenging. But did get it. I had to. Do, I made that header. I don't know how many times. I had to modify it. I don't ever want to do that ever again. Glad it's over. And uh, in case, for those who don't know, um, uh, Mercy Lago engine actually sits offset to the driver's side, and that's just for uh, the reason for the the rear diff and also uh, the gearbox. This is the transfer case. I had a lot of people um, asking questions about the gearbox, and um, a lot of people think that uh, Mercy Lago or Diablo has a transaxle. So they don't, they just have a gearbox. Um, and I'll go over the drive, I'll make a separate video of the drivetrain. Um, but you can, you can see here, once it's installed, one of the reasons why the engine actually offsets to the driver's side and I'm offset a half inch from center OEM is one inch I just can't go the full one inch um, because my chassis is actually built off an early Diablo design and the Mercy Lago um, chassis were actually a little bit wider in the engine cradle um, so there was a little bit more points for headers and also for the engine to offset more um, so I didn't have the luxury of that. Um, so I had to make a few adjustments and um, I'll go over that stuff too. Some of the brackets and stuff in a later video. But I just wanted to go over the exhaust. And um, that's it. Uh, keep watching and I'll, uh, I'll post a video uh, of the drivetrain. Alright, have a good one.